Ooh, here we go, a 2001. This one could be rotated. It's a $1 coin. There's $20 worth in this roll. We've got an Anzac coin on this end, so that could be something as well. Ooh, sport for choice. A couple of enders. We call it enders when there's something on the end of a coin roll that could be, could be something special. We'll start with that 2001. We'll flip it around. Okay, we're gonna check these for rotations. You hold it at the top and the bottom. Give it a little twirl. Ah, uh, it's not. The queen's pointing to three o'clock where she's supposed to be, but sometimes she can be pointing in different directions. This Anzac coin, if it's a 2014, then it's not worth holding on to, but if it's a 15, 16, 17, or 18, it is. Let's flip it, flip it around. Yes, a 2015. So these 2015s, uh, let's have a look at my list. $2.20 to $12.95, only 1.4 million of these minted. Yeah, it's got a bit of blue color through it, so someone's added a bit of color some, somehow, but that's cool. And Zach coin, 2015, I like it, cool. All right, let's look at all of these coins and see if we've got anything. Oh man, these ones can have that double rim, $1 mule they call it. $6,900 if it's got a double rim. One of those sold for $6,900 in really good condition. They generally sell, if they're in quite worn condition like this coin here, between about $300 and $600 odd dollars they sell for. But um, man, it's got a really light strike on the date there, hasn't it, this one here? They call it a, a weak strike or oil strike or struck through. A bit of foreign material on the die that strikes the coin and it prevents some of the detail coming through. I'll put it aside, just out of interest rates. Yeah, cool. 2019, got the A privy mark underneath the kangaroo here and the little 35 over that, that side there. So these ones here, um, not a heap of value. $2.50 was a, a recent selling price on one of those. So not a heap of extra value, but $2.50 is better than $1. So, hmm. Okay, this is what we've got. Ooh, what have we got here? We've got a Great Aussie Coin Hunt K for Koala. Um, this would be a 2021, 2021 version. So about two to six dollars for something like that. Yeah, cool. All right, a 2016. This is pretty shiny. It's sort of in your face, this one. This is like in good condition. Yeah, um, cool. Oh, that's probably better than the one I've got for my own collection. So I'll put that aside for sure. Like it. And that'd be worth more to coin collectors as well. Like if you listed that on a place like eBay, maybe about six or so dollars, yeah, in that sort of condition. All right, last coin here, but geez, that shiny one, shiny.